Hallo und willkommen zu Lone Star. Wir spielen Valkyrie hier Chronicles und wir sind endlich beim Midsummer Incident. Welkin Gunther reporting, Captain. Hey, Welkin. You got called in too, Faldio? I apologize for calling the two of you in on an off-duty day. Princess Cordelia has graciously extended banquet invitations to the three of us. What? But why us? It seems you two will be recognized for your successes at Vassal and more recent ops. The event will be held tomorrow at the castle. Oh. I'm not really good with the formal stuff. What are you, crazy? Do you have any clue how rare a chance to meet the princess is? They say that House Rangrys, the Archdukes of Gallia, are descended from the Valkyra. If that's true, Princess Cordelia herself is a Valkyria, and we get an audience with her. Well, yeah, I guess. Just don't forget to wear dress uniforms, gentlemen. I'll meet you both at Castle Randgrees tomorrow evening. You're dismissed until then. Yeah, so much for my plans to go bird watching tomorrow. I hope they don't mess this up. Sorry to keep you, Captain. Goodness, Welkin, I hardly recognized you. Yes, Captain. Alicia helped me get ready this evening. She kept punching me when I told her she couldn't come with me. I'm still sore. <laughs> well, consider it combat experience. Wow, Welkin. No grass stains or anything. Very funny, Faldio. Nice hat, by the way. Yeah, I never did like the look of these ugly things. I've been boycotting them. Hey, don't you all look nice. Good evening, Miss Ellet. Here to cover the banquet tonight? You know it. Apparently, an ambassador from the Federation's been invited to the party. I smell a plan to sign up an alliance between Gallia and the Federation at work here. But Gallia's national policy has always been to shun alliances and remain neutral. I figure it's mostly the idea of Prime Minister Borg, Princess Cordelia's regent. He's using her youth as carte blanche to do whatever he and the other nobles want. With all due respect, the princess isn't much more than a mouthpiece for his policies now. Ugh. We're about to attend a banquet, and now I've gone and lost my appetite. It's about time to enter. Let's go. Your Highness, thank you for your presence on this occasion. Might you grace this assemblage with a word? Honored ladies and gentlemen, if I may, I appear before you today at the peak of joy. For now, two great powers join together. Gallia and the Federation pledge their allegiance as we seek to build together an eternal peace for your Ich schon vergessen, dass nicht nur in Star Wars die Frauen immer dämliche Hüte haben. The honor of dear Gallia, in fact her very freedom 
is currently under attack and hangs by the thinnest thread you can imagine. But, while Princess Cordelia remains on the throne, she who is the scion of the Valkyra's ancient blood promise, no force on this earth will ever see this nation defeated. Is that not so, Princess? Yes. I draw strength from the Valkyrian bloodline. And my heart is a repository of justice. I am nearly at a loss for words. The privilege of brokering peace with you, your highness, has been the greatest honor of my life, and I thank you for it. With bountiful stores of Ragnite, and your strategic position between East and West, you've become the foundation of Europa. In this time of peril, the foundation is grateful, and happily joins hands in crushing the Imperial threat before us. <laughs> They just want to be sure they're the ones who control us when this is over. Make no mistake, the Federation would conquer Europa the same as the Empire. This is stupid. It is hard to accept what he's saying. As long as we fight as one, the Empire's forces will never be a danger. We shall topple the Empire and rid the world of their threat. And then we shall unify Europa and govern under our great banners. Jetzt seid ihr wieder freie Bürger des Staates Macquadera. Mm. All of Europa. Well, there's something we haven't heard before. We're not fighting this war so we can invade another country. Absolutely. All we want is to keep our homes and our families safe. Now, my friend, let us put an end to all these formalities and raise a glass to honor this historic alliance. Yes, a toast to the shining future that awaits. Cheers! Cheers! <sighs> Where are you going? I've got a bad taste in my mouth. This is garbage. I'm out of here. I'm going home, Welkin. See ya. Faldio? <sighs> I'm glad that's over. We should be heading back soon. I believe the exit was this way. Oh! <laughs> Princess Cordelia! I'm so terribly sorry. Are you all right, Your Highness? I am unharmed. I cannot begin to apologize. Please forgive my clumsiness. Do not trouble yourself. I bid you a safe return and a good night. <sighs> Your Highness, are you really in support of an alliance with the Federation? Lieutenant Gunther, have you lost your mind? Please forgive me. I'm aware that what I'm saying may be out of line. But I... Seeing you tonight, I got the feeling that your opinion is being ignored. I am still young. All political matters are handled by my regent, Borg. We are the Borg. The protection of Gallia and of the Valkyrian bloodline is my fated onus. Their protection does not require my personal feelings. I need only live by the laws set forth by those who come before me. I bid you once more, good night. Your Highness. Do you copy? It's me. The mark is alone. Now is our chance. You know the plan. Have the armored car on standby. Once I have the mark, I'll be there. Well, I'll leave you here. Good night, Wilkin. Good night, Captain. Wait! Hold it, Verat! Verat! Terrible news! 
General Damon, what's the problem? P Princess Cordelia's been kidnapped! Kidnapped? It can't be. Yes. It was that Federation ambassador. He was a spy all along. So the Federation takes her under their protection, and Galia along with her. Typical, considering the sorts of backroom dealings and extortion they've used till now. So get on it! Verat, you've got to get her back! Understood. Lieutenant, gather your squad immediately. Yes, Captain. Ja, die Schweine haben einfach die Princess Cordelia entführt. Das können wir nicht zulassen. Hey, Casey, what is that thing? It's an airplane. The first test flight succeeded during EW1. Now research is going on all over the world. Whoa, so this is what one of those things looks like. Man, I want up in one. Oh, hello, Leon. Chris? Hey, Sara, you got the day off. What are you hanging around here for? Wait, let me guess. Are you building this airplane, Isara? Yes. There's still a ways to go before it's complete, but the basic construction is done. Leave it to you, Isara. You learned all this on your own? I'm working from documents my father collected before his death. That's amazing. I'm so impressed. So where are you flying to once it's all done? Going on a trans gallian tour, maybe? First, I'd like to take my brother up in it. Once, when we were young, he and I were out bird watching when he mentioned it. That he wished he could fly like they did. That's my goal. I've been pursuing this project bit by bit in my free time. Oh, that's real sweet! Hey, Sara, can I ask you a favor? Please, let me help you build your airplane. What? I want to become an engineer of your caliber someday, Isara. I feel like watching you work would help me learn a great deal. Please, Isara. Oh, yeah, that's true. Hey, then can I help out too? Come on! You don't mind? Of course not. I may not look bright, but I've been working my butt off in R&D for a while. Of course. Well, thank you both. All right! That's... that's the emergency siren. What's happening at this hour? Let's ready the Edelweiss. I'm sure that whatever it is, it's urgent. Absolutely. I'll help you prep it. Ja, the kidnapping of Cordelia. Das können wir natürlich überhaupt nicht erlauben. Wo kommen wir denn dahin? Es fragt sich, wo kriegt jetzt ein ganzes Team hier? Also, wie, wie viel Zeit lassen sich da die Gegner, äh, die Cordelia wegzuschaffen? We have an emergency on our hands. Princess Cordelia has been kidnapped by Federation operatives. The armored vehicle carrying the princess is headed for the port at the southern end of the combat area. Spread out your soldiers and stop that vehicle. Your objective is to disable the vehicle's engine and rescue Princess Cordelia. Use rifles and machine guns to strike the vehicle's weak point and bring it to a stop. Explosive weapons like tank cannons, lances and grenades are off limits. The risk to the princess is too great. Letting the car reach either of these two points will mean allowing the escape. We can't let that happen. We've also got word that Federation Special Forces... <coughs> Forces... <laughs> Man, I must have a slug drink. We've also got word that Federation Special Forces have been sighted in the area. They'll be protecting the vehicle. 
They may be wearing galleon uniforms, but they are real fats. Don't think twice about pulling those triggers. It's a dark night out there. You won't be able to get a visual or enemies past a certain distance. Stay sharp. Also, wir müssen also den Motor außer Betrieb setzen. Das Auto darf nicht explodieren. Es darf nicht den Hafen erreichen. Welkin darf nicht umkommen. Es darf keine 20 Runden dauern. Und die dürfen unser Camp nicht einnehmen. Ja, 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 ja. Na dann. Dann positionieren wir mal. Wir haben nicht viele Plätze, wo wir Leute hin tun können. Deswegen kommt hier unten Lago. The last line of defense. Dann. Nehmen wir hier Alicia. Ja, müssen wir ganz hoch. Ah. Springt manchmal Alicia. Und dann brauchen wir natürlich Rosie. Und dann nehmen wir Weiß. Oh, der kommt woanders hin. Nehmen wir hier. Weiß. Ja. Deploy. Your mission is to rescue her highness unharmed. Failure isn't an option on this one, soldiers. They can't get to the harbor. We stop them here. Squad 7, move out. Ja, die Edelweiß sieht ja schon cool aus mit den neuen Anbauten. To the harbor, full steam. The ship's waiting there to take us out of Gallia. Apologies for the cramped quarters, your highness. We'll have you comfortable soon. Lieutenant, it's likely the Ambassador has the Princess with him inside that armored vehicle. Use firearms to stop it with minimal force, then recover the Princess. Don't lose them. Tank shells, anti-tank lances, and grenades are off-limits. You could harm the Princess. Understood, Captain. Welks, even if we can't attack with it, the Edelweiss can still block their path. Yeah, on a narrow road like this, there's no room to slip past a tank in your way. Sounds like a plan. Let's get the princess back safe. Gut, dann fangen wir mal an. Und zwar mit einer Order. Damage Boost. This is an order. Hurting them means us surviving. Be merciless. Order. Defense boost. This is an order. Brace up and get ready to defend yourself.
Gut. Bin doch jetzt weiß I'll dran. Take care of it. There's another one. Einer weniger. Der Lancer lässt uns ja in Ruhe. Und mal schauen, ob wir so weit wie möglich vorkommen. Und sind hinten dran. Und zielen. Und Feuer. Das war's für den Motor. Operation Complete. Operation Complete. Let's get her Highness out of there. Kidnapping of Cordelia, Combat Report, Base Result 12.360 Experience für eine Runde Rang A, 24.720 Punkte und für den, ja, für den Transporter gibt es nochmal 1.500 oben drauf, macht 38.580 Punkte und 67.500 DCT Geld. Nice! Your Highness, are you all right? I am unharmed. Oh, good. Being princess ain't all fancy dinners, huh? Gotta be hard carrying a whole country. Can it, Rosie? That's the Princess of Gallia you're talking to. No, it's quite all right. She speaks the truth. As Scion of the Valkyrer, it is my fate to live and die for Gallia's well-being. Are you sure that isn't just your excuse, Your Highness? What? If you label the status quo fate, you can run from the responsibility of changing it. You too, Welkin. Have a little respect here. Every living thing in this world struggles to live and pass life on to a new generation. They use all the instincts and animal wisdom they can just to live that one day longer. That powerful animal will to live is... I think it's a beautiful part of nature. <sighs> Your Highness may be descended from Valkyra, and that may carry a burden. The old ways and traditions you follow may be important to uphold. But I hope that you won't throw away the will to live your own life because of them. That's enough, Welkin. Give it a rest. Perhaps it is as you say, and I have been running from responsibility unknowingly. It is indeed mine to consider my life's role within the Valkyrian bloodline. Your Highness. I am most envious of your ability to speak your mind so frankly. But time enough remains to consider my role by my own will. Thank you for your words, Lieutenant. Not at all. Wow! Even a princess's gut will wake up and say hi when it's empty. I... I am. Rumbling bellies are a clever bit of animal wisdom all humans share. Alicia, have we got anything to eat? You bet. I brought some of the cinnamon rolls I baked this morning. Genau, was man so braucht auf einem Kampfeinsatz. Here you are, Your Highness. Bisschen epa brot Thank you kindly. Let's put it on a tray. Nice. I have not had such bread before, but it is quite agreeable. <laughs> I'm glad. All right. Let's get her highness back to the capital.
And so Princess Cordelia returned, safe through the efforts of Militia Squad 7. Its leader, Welkin Gunther, was celebrated as rescuer to the nation's sovereign and awarded the prestigious Gallian Medal of Honor. Lieutenant Welkin Gantha, step forward. Sir, for excellence in valor and deed, you are hereby awarded this honor. Your Highness, please bestow the medal upon the young lieutenant. Gladly. Congratulations, Lieutenant Gunther. Thank you, Your Highness. Though I have yet to reach an answer, your question drives me still. To understand my responsibility as sovereign and as a single human life. Your Highness. Oh, and know that one tradition already lies sundered by my will. I had the cooks add cinnamon rolls to my daily breakfast. Alicia will be happy to hear it. Lieutenant Gunther, you forget yourself. Sir, my apologies. With this, today's ceremonies are ended. Highness, would you grace us with a word? Lieutenant Gunther, I hope your allegiance to Gallia stands firm evermore. Yes, Princess. Lieutenant Gunther, I am sorry. There is something more I have not told you. Please, be safe. Welkin, I'm coming in. Sure, it's open. Ooh, is that it? Not bad, man. You sure made a name for yourself this time. It was pure luck I was there. Mal abgesehen davon, dass es weiß war. So have you seen the headlines? The ones that say nothing about the kidnapping? That reporter tells me Borg's the one pressuring the media into suppressing it. But why suppress it? If word got out about what happened, Galia's relationship with the Federation would suffer. We've got our hands full fending off the Empire. We can't afford a war on two fronts. So he has the whole thing covered up. I'll bet he goes on acting like it never happened. Wow. Welkin, this hurts. It's painfully obvious how shaky Gallia's standing is. I know the world's history is an endless chain of big fish eating little fish. Both of us know the weak bow to the strong. It's history and it's nature. A minor nation like ours is an easy mark, even before you add the rift within our army. Welkin, no offense, but I hope nature's wrong this time. I don't know what to tell you, Faldio. Chapter 10, Liberation of Fausen. Fausen, das ist mal wieder so ein Wort, ob ich das mir merken kann. The decorations tab is now available. Yay! About decorations. Meeting certain conditions as you proceed through the game may earn you decorations. You can view any awards you've earned in the decorations tab. Open the Y button menu and choose the decorations tab to view a list of your awards or, after meeting a set condition, you can go to the audience hall via the headquarters tab where Princess Cordelia will present them to you in person. Nice! The audience hall is now available. The personal tab has been updated. The glossary tab has been updated. Cordelia awaits in the audience hall. Na dann. Wollen wir sie doch nicht warten lassen, würde ich sagen, oder? Das gehört sich nicht. Ähm. 
Aber hat sie mir gesagt, wo ich sie finde? Given to a galleon who has performed exemplary service in a military or civilian office. Audience Hall. How have you been, Your Highness? Very well, Lieutenant Gunther. And all the better for seeing you again. I thank you again for the valor you showed in assisting me that night. Not at all. I was just relieved to see you were unharmed, Highness. It wasn't until I saw my friends gawk at that medal that I realized how special it was. <laughs> you truly are a rare individual. It is the duty of a nation to acknowledge and reward the loyal deeds of its people. Medals and trinkets are the only form we have, but we ask that you wear them proudly. Yes, ma'am. And thank you, Your Highness. I hear your accomplishments do not end with that knight's bravery, either. The stories of your accomplishments suggest I owe you a great deal more than that. Lieutenant Welkin Gunther, step forward. In honor of your manifold accomplishments, you are hereby awarded this honor. Highness, it's an honor! The Lance of Gallia awarded. The Crimson Heart awarded. May your allegiance to Gallia stand firm evermore. Kein Problem, werden wir auch befördert, das wäre doch mal was. Wir haben 40.000 Experience. Setzen wir das doch mal ins Training. Welcome to your worst nightmare, maggots! Train all you want! I've got all day! Gut. Erstmal kommen die Sniper auf 8. Oh, das verbraucht so viele Punkte alles. Engineers of nine. You're better than this. Push those limits. Good work, maggots. You're one level closer to human. Looks like that session beat a new potential out of the engineers. Looks like that session beat a new potential out of the snipers. Ja, jetzt bräuchte man noch 24.000, um die alle ein Level zu pushen. Eigentlich sollte ich mit Ingenieur auf 10 kommen und auf Sniper auf 9. Aber es kann sein, dass vielleicht in dieser überarbeitenden Fassung, dass da jetzt ein bisschen was fehlt. Dann machen wir vielleicht... Vielleicht mal die Engineers hm, erstmal. Dann haben wir 10, 10, 10, 10 und 8. Und dann müssen wir schauen, dass wir noch ein paar Punkte für die Sniper bekommen. Da fehlen dann noch 4000. I got no use for tears. Sweat, sweat, sweat. Good work, maggots. You're one level closer to human. Ja, lass uns erstmal gut sein. Come back anytime you're ready to sweat. Ja, 
Schauen wir noch in R&D. Welcome, Bro. I'm stoked you're here, man. So, also. Wir kommen endlich auf Aim B. Treffen damit besser. Machen einen mehr Schaden und zwei mehr gegen Amor. It's done! Da gibt's immer noch nichts. Wir warten mal ab, bis das kommt. Genauso hier. Sniper gibt's nichts. Aber es gibt eine neue Granate. Macht 25 mehr Schaden gegen Personen und 25 mehr gegen Amor. All set for you, bro. It's Dann. Ja, ich finde es ganz lustig, wie der Kopf hier immer länger wird. Hier ist ein Stückchen größer und hier ist die Granate einfach länger. Dafür ist sie nicht mehr ganz so dick. Naja. Und es gibt eine neue Uniform. Here you go, bro. Tut mir leid, dass ich dich da unterbreche. Hammer Upgrade. All set for you, bro. It's done. Sehr schön. Sehr schön. Edelweiß. Ja. Als wenn man dann beim Panzer guckt, der hat zum Beispiel hier bei dem Turm jetzt hier diese Schilde bekommen. Die sieht man dann auch immer. It's done. This one's perfect, bro. So, und dann können wir das Rohr noch verbessern. All set for you, bro. It's done. Das sieht also auch dann wirklich so aus, wenn man sich den Panzer anguckt. Hier gibt's ein Side Upgrade. Here you go, bro. All done. Ja, da müssen wir uns hier jetzt echt mal Gedanken machen, was wir reinstopfen. Weil das natürlich so, dass man ja sehr wenig Platz hat und sich arg überlegen muss, was man überhaupt reintut. gerade nicht geklappt. So. Ich muss warten, bis man da ankommt. Gut. Der verbraucht zwei Plätze. Wir haben hier plus zwölf. Aber sieben plus fünf sind drei... Ähm, sind auch zwölf. verbraucht bloß drei Plätze. Nehmen wir mal die Platte mit rein. Ich habe noch gar nicht geschaut, ob wir noch was anderes brauchen. Magazin brauchen wir nicht, oder? Ich weiß auch gar nicht, was der Unterschied ist. Das sollen wir mal mitnehmen. Plus 25. Wollte ich nicht. Dass man das da auch noch so reinpassen muss, macht das echt unnötig kompliziert. Oder wir machen es vielleicht so. Tun wir die zwei eins runter. Ba 
bauen den da rein. Und lass uns damit mal gut sein. Come back again soon, bro. I mean it, man. Castle Front Street. Hey, dropping by to read the writing on the wall? That's a good man. Princess kidnapping foiled. A wall exclusive scoop. Early morning on the 23rd, Princess Cordelia was abducted and taken forcibly from the grounds of Castle Rundgrees. Subsequent investigations have shown the culprit was Federation Ambassador Townshend in Gaia on an official visit. After a banquet, banquet at the castle, he forced the princess into an armored vehicle he had prepared and made for the port. Thankfully, his escape was thwarted by members of Squad 7 of the Gallian Militia, who safely recovered Princess Cordelia in time. The Gallian government has declined to address this matter publicly. Likely in an effort not to endanger relations with the Federation, while Gallia remains locked in combat with the Empire's forces. Militia Lieutenant Decorated Castle Rangree's Audience Hall saw an award ceremony on the 28th, in which Militia Officer Lieutenant Belkin Gunter, 22, was presented the prestigious Gallian Medal of Honor, given to those who have gone above and beyond the call of duty in service of Gallia's interests. Medal was presented by Princess Cordelia herself, who also graced the young soldier with wishes for his continued loyalty. After the ceremony, Gunter addressed the press, saying that he had hoped to do right by his honor by becoming a better man and officer. Medal hung proudly around his neck. The Gunter family has the rare distinction of being among the first to receive the highest of awards twice in as many generations. Da 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 da! I've got new material! Squad 7's R&R. &R. For 50,000! Okay. <laughs> Thanks a million! 50,000? Nur für den Report. Come back and see Hat the writing on the wall again soon. I'll be waiting for you. Ja, was es mit dem Report auf sich hat, schauen wir aber nicht mehr heute nach. Ich würde sagen, machen wir an dieser Stelle doch ein kleines Päuschen und ich hoffe, es hat euch gefallen. Und wir sehen uns das nächste Mal.